we are. Oh, one second. We wasting our time already. Let's just start. Our story begins with a man named Martin Luther. They already know his name. Like I said, our story begins with a man named Martin Luther. Okay, so how is your path of becoming a great lawyer? No, Dad, don't be silly. I'm going to be monk now. You're, You're going to be a monk now? Why a sudden change of heart? Well, that was this storm. <laughs> that I will become a monk for the rest of my life if you just allow me to live in this storm right now. Please, please. Martin Luther then applied as a monk and was accepted by the church. In 1507, Martin Luther was ordained as a priest, which authorized him to perform the Holy Sacrament of Communion. His father attended his first Mass, celebration, which was a very special celebration. Unfortunately, his father didn't come to this occasion to celebrate, but to confront Luther about his choice. This led to a bad relationship between him and his father. I hereby appoint you as Professor of Wittenberg. We are having troubles establishing this university. Finally, I'm able to show my skills in talking theological discussions with others. Yes! <laughs> no! Martin? May I help you, ma'am? Yes, I will sign you to a mission in Rome, and it will be mandatory for you to begin getting ready for your trip. Okay, I'll get ready for my journey to Rome, correct? Yes, get on now. We don't have time to waste. Go spread the Lord's word. Over time in Martin's journey, he was shocked about what the church had done. Martin wanted to show the true way to get to heaven, even though the church had been wrong. Finish writing these 95 theses. This will make history. October 31st in 1517, there were a lot of months and, and even a king. king. But at one church down in Europe over in Germany, Martin Luther wanted to nail these. They were theses or statements they said was true And he found them in the Bible wasn't anything new Wait, we need to back up and say what happened first He was stuck in a storm, it couldn't get any worse It made him realize that his life belonged to God So then he became a monk and his life was very odd He learned about the church, they were doing crazy things Like making people pay with unnecessary blink Martin Luther disagreed I don't think that's right. In order to get to heaven, you walk by faith and sight. See, there was a man named Jesus. He came to show the way. In order to get to heaven, you never have to pay. Instead, you must believe in God and Jesus Christ, who gave his life to die for you. Wow, isn't that?